everybody and welcome to the second video on our Urbex Media channel. Um, if the cars behind me disturb the intro then I'm very sorry but we're right next to our main road. Um, behind us is actually an abandoned military base. During the First World War it was actually used to train um, the army and it was later used into the Second World War um, actually for the RAF. In the First World War this was the British training camp. It hosted up to 200,000 soldiers during the war. In the Second World War, it was then changed into a refugee camp which housed uh, German, Austrian and Polish refugees. And then it was now into a skydiving club. Fact. Remember to follow us on our Instagram page. I'll put it down here below. We're really active on there. But um, for now, let's get straight into our second video. What are you going to try and do as well? Are you going to try and maybe get in there? No. I, I don't know, it, might, it would look so sick. Yeah, it's just getting out of it. I reckon... If I run and jump, I can just get up. Let me take on a look. So our intro is filmed over there, so what we've done is we've gone through the inside and we've come around the tunnel. The tunnel actually goes all the way in and all the way down. What I'm worried about is because it's only one length. Will it come through? If I pull it all, all my way on it. If it falls back, I'm, I'm gonna hurt. Yep, he's got it. You would have me smiling. The whole roof here is caved in. It used to be completely outer shelled all the way along. Follow us inside now. Oh, that's a good spot. It's not quite clear. Right? I mean, the whole carcass of the car is here. Obviously the steering wheel and the front bit, the core of it, <laughs> and the, even the top is, is, is all there. I mean. James, guess what? Not shotgun. Mind now, take the photo from as close as you can to us. Try and get closer for the dates or writing if you can get me. Because it got turned into the sky, yeah. Uh, Started in 1960. Obviously during the First World War, this is where the, it was a trench training kind of camp kind of thing. Um, the bricks were obviously all fucking broke. But they would have more than likely had trenches going around to reenact it all. The outline of a bunker, um, which James is now climbing upon now, well, what we're going to do is have a look inside and see if there's any remains inside it. So, as you can see by the landscape, this kind of army base is completely in the middle of nowhere. It's it's just off the road, but you wouldn't know it was here if you were just driving past, you know, you weren't looking for it. 
behind us, as you can see, that's the airbase. Um, that's now an airfield where they train. Um, where they used to train the Sky RAF, but it's now skydiving. It's now like skydiving kind of centre. Um, but anyway, either way, this place is still pretty much intact. Um, we don't know how much more there was here. And we're off to another job now. We're going to check out an abandoned hotel. Um, that will be in the next video. It will be in our next video, so look out for that. Check out our Instagram below. Uh, we hope you've enjoyed the video. Leave a like, subscribe if you're new. We'll see you guys in the next video. Why'd you stop it again? Just leave it rolling. I've restarted it. Hello. Strength, Jake. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Is that well, that was fucking dreadful. That was all I got up there. Yeah, with them fucking superhuman stick gloves. <laughs> How strong are those vines? Not strong at all. Now how do I get down? Huh? We never think of how to get down. You never think of how to get down, no that's correct. Nice! Guess what? He's done it! Get it! Oh yes!